Hi, I'm Jonathan Clancy. I'm Director of Collections and Preservation at the Stickley Museum at Craftsman Farms. Standing here in the dining room of the log house, and I wanted to show you these three pieces of pottery from our collection. We have here a piece of bird cliff, and the reason I chose these three is because they're built differently. And when you actually examine them and sort of hold them, you can tell the difference. So this pot is pretty heavy, and the reason it's heavy, and if you feel inside of it, it feels a little lumpy, is because it's hand-built, and so it's built with coils. Now, by contrast, this piece of Clifton here, which is in the center and has this crystalline, crystal patina glaze, as they call it, is molded, and as a result, it's very light, it's very consistent, and if you feel the inside of the pot, there's no ridges, no lumps, it's just all perfectly smooth. Um, we know when this was made, in fact, because Clifton dated all their pieces. So on the bottom, it says Clifton 1906, and it's got the decorator's monogram on it. The last piece over here is a piece made by Hugh Robertson for Dedham Pottery. And Dedham's thought of as really glazed experimenters. And what's surprising in some ways is that all of the pots are hand-thrown. And so when you feel the inside of a dedum pot, like any pot that's thrown, you're going to feel different ridges in it. And you're going to feel them sort of spiral and build up to the top. And then it gets a little bit smoother up here where you can tell they sort of finished the neck of it. Um, it's an amazing uh, piece of pottery. It's, it's one of my favorites that we have here. And like many pieces of Dedham, it's inscribed on the bottom, Dedham Pottery, with Hugh Robertson's initials. So we hope that you're enjoying uh, your, your quarantine, which is always difficult. And we're trying to bring you a little content and keep you close to the museum, even though you're far away at home. Thanks for watching.